Hi, Reshma. Hi, hi. Sit. Christmas was the every day just the same. Yeah. I put it every time first week of uh, December and I remove it off the first week of January. So what do you think is lacking in society right now? What? It's not just a woman's uh, job or duty, no? Correct. In the political world, there are a lot of gay family, there are a lot of gay boys, all of them are committing suicide because there's nobody to talk to. We always have expectations, we always expect. Work, well, of course. வெல்கம் So Reshma, so I thought, well, ah. start having a coffee before that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. So I'm a cup of coffee. So Reshma, so today I thought, sorry, when uh, Christmas was there, even though both of us don't practice the religion, for us every religion is the same. Yeah. We believe in God at the end of the day. It's a universal gift. Reshma, I tell, I want people to know how interesting your job is. People, just tell people what you do. I work as a local producer. So you pretty much work with an international market where you yes. are a line producer. So So you 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 not in town and uh, we place it as my sister reshma so reshma is my neighbor and a very very close friend of mine romba varsham theriyadha nanu irukku enna solradhu or confidant nu solla or sister nu solla or friend nu solla or family ellame solla avanga putti so every time christmas we tour around it's always nice to put up with people you really love rather than being all by yourself so that's why i thought okay for nabi's called reshma who's a valuable show of mine to start off this festive season with her so we block padina the christmas tree padaporam About this Christmas tree, Reshma will tell you. I always believe in recycling. I never believe in throwing things and wasting things. This was gifted to me by Shireen Jha, a very good friend of mine. This is a tree which she used. I want to use my tree now. But I wanted to gift my tree to one of the orphanages, so I gave my tree to the orphanage. And she said, "Karun, I heard that you don't have a tree, and you're looking for a tree." So she gave me this tree last year. So it's a white it's tree. A white First time having a white tree. Yeah. So I'm just going to fix it. So I'm guessing this is the second bit. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Wait a minute. Yeah. So see how beautifully it sits. Looking lovely, no? Yeah. Ah, it's a nice tree. So it on the we have to push just push the tree. Now, after that, put up, bro. If you continue pulling, now the tree will. Uh, it's a nice tree for this corner of this wall. Yeah. So Reshma. Yeah. So tell me something. Are you single? Uh. No comments. No comments. So, so I want all you guys to say Reshma Singhal, and she's a very good-looking girl and a very hard-working girl. So, anybody out there who really wants to date Reshma, uh, please don't DM and torture her. Uh, you can find it out eventually, wherever you have to find it out. So, now on the report, the post for time, put a post, Resh. Yeah. About uh, being single in town, and uh, it's a black and white photo shoot I put about in Instagram, saying that uh, there's so much grayness in my life. I'm waiting for a day for uh, color to come into my life. What is your take on relationships? I think if uh, if two people in a relationship actually like uh, they actually take each other up and evolve, then it's worth it to be in a relationship. It's a healthy relationship. Yeah. Okay. Otherwise, uh, it's better to be single than be in a toxic relationship. People believe that it's so important to be in a relationship because that's the norm the biological clock is ticking all of those things i don't believe in and it's quite sad what is a toxic relationship where i mean usually i mean it happens both ways it happens also with the women being toxic but most often you see it's the men that that are being toxic controlling the women checking on them jealousy gaslighting them mm. making them believe they they insane trying to dominate them mm. not making them feel special or wonderful mm. and always taking and expecting women to do everything mm. like they have to cook they have to clean 
they have to work they have to look after themselves so i think it's a two way street no so the guys should be equally involved with whatever the girl yes. is doing too in everything including like changing kids diapers if that comes to that ha huh? cooking it's not just a woman's uh, job or duty no third what do you what do you think is lacking in society right now what is is it society that is forcing these kind of women to get into such such toxic relationships people are other than like uh, okay women also grow up in this uh, um, watching movies where it's romantic and they romanticize and there's no reality and then they they end up growing up in an environment where they believe it's important to be in a relationship and mm. they put up and make all those sacrifices and th- this also is bordering on abuse right Correct. and abuse and mental health and all are things that it's untouched yeah that's why i want to do this even though it's a fun uh, vlog of us putting up a tree the only thing i want to address is mental health which i think all of us go through once one such is once one part of our lives and a lot of big stars from deepika padukone to a lot of people have spoken about uh, mental health so a lot of people actually uh, don't uh, understand the tradition of christmas because normally they say that you put it for 13 days or for one month so i put it every time first week of uh, december and remove it of the first week of january so mm-hmm. i keep it pretty for much on the second to second for a full month because i feel lights and all these things give more uh, happiness do you think the see, see when i come to your house you have all these serial lights hanging outside yeah that brings me joy to see it's something little or something festive yeah like i i was going through like a lot of people don't know this but i was going through a lot of mental uh, depression to myself like i was fearing death you know i spoke about actually i don't talk about it in the christmas vlog but enna na vand saavu pathukom bye bye amshra na friends rendu mundu friends vand samir sethi rendu adukapra rahul rendu ellarume they all passed with heart attacks so i started getting scared thinking about what if it's me next I started eating healthy. I started rice in the night time. I started cutting down alcohol. I uh, started uh, slowly start working out. I got scared because tomorrow if I am not there, who will take care of my mother? Then I realized that my mother is fine to take care of herself. But things that I would, I would never want to leave this world like this, you know? So in today's world, life is so precious. when god has given us something like that. So Naripi wrote that message for now. Mariya, I am going to kill myself. I am going to kill myself. I am not happy. I am like... Are you mad? People are dying in today's world, and they don't want you to die. Here, God's given you a life. Why do you want to die? You know. So I think that's very important. That mental health. If you poor, you are rather only going to have a mental health problem. Now, you're feeling very depressed. There are other people facing it. Or a best friend, or you know, or anybody, or neighbor, or you know, teachers, or you know, other people facing it. And when they bottle up, put you under extreme, 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 that's why they have suicide, they have tapa, and they have suicide. So, I avoid that because I have mental disturbance. That is, na always talk to somebody you love. And if you look at all the people, Nariya children, Nariya family, and then Nariya gay boys, all of them are committing suicide because there's nobody to talk to. The example is a boy who died in Pune, a school boy, such a handsome boy, such a lovely boy, tenth or eleventh or boy. His mother, single mother. So nobody expected that a boy like him would kill himself. But in school, he was bullied, he was harassed. He committed suicide. Perfect in studies, oh, yeah. everything. Mother still blaming his mother, thinking, "What did I do wrong? Where did I go wrong?" but it is not the mother's fault mother didn't neglect the child it's society it's a school so i keep always saying we need to start having education starting in schools yeah sensitize the society society yeah. and educate the parents first of all i think everything starts at home because this festive season i want to bring in awareness to the community i want to bring awareness to households to families saying that your child is your child it's not the society's responsibility it's your responsibility to see that the child lives a good life you know understanding acceptance everything Like because a child is feminine, don't beat the child. If a child is having some problem with the tuition teacher, ask why. Maybe the tuition teacher is sexually abusing the child. Maybe the bus driver or the cab driver, if the child doesn't want to go with them, ask why. Maybe there's some story to it. People neglect these kind of st- issues, and that's why all these children are suffering so much in today's world. Is what I feel. But in this festive season, on the brighter note, on the happier side, uh, what are you? What are your res- resolutions for the coming New Year? No resolutions. I'm just happy that COVID has come to an end, and then 2023 is definitely going to be better for everybody. Everybody, yeah. As things are opening up and a yeah. lot of stuff. I think it's high time people get their lives back together. Yeah. Not bad. We finished most of the tree. Yeah, the tree. but I think it's important to be also comfortable with oneself. But yes, we have expectations. I think when we lower our expectations, we do live a better, better life. Yeah. But we we'll fail to do it, no. We always have expectations. We always expect. Work, of course. It's the other work. person to give us love and affection, and we don't get it. We get so frustrated. I have cats. They give me a lot of love and affection. Yeah. So, Amrita, now they're poor. Okay. How many cats do you have? Four. Four. So, Reshma has like four cats in the house. So that's what keeps her occupied. Yeah. 
keeps me happy. So, transition period, I put my mama on the actual. She was not expected to come today. One time I see my mama Nikki. So, I told my mama on the last tradition to put the star on top. So, with Reshma and my mother, let's just do this. So, my put the star on top. The Romba Ashma Moon Vice and the Terinja Lende or Christmas or Perry event. ரொம்ப சந்தோஷமா இருக்கு அம்மா அக்ஷர் நான் வரமாட்டேன் வச்சு ஊர்ல இருந்து நாளைக்கு காலை வரவேண்டியது ஆனா நான் ஈவினிங் வந்துட்டேன் எனக்கு சப்ரைஸ் பண்றதுக்கு சோ காட் இஸ் கைட் டு ட்ரெடிஷன் படி அவங்க ஸ்டார் வச்சிட்டாங்க ஐ அம் வெரி ஹாப்பி மை சிஸ்டர் ரேஷ்மா வாஸ் ஹெல்ப் மீ டுடே டு டாக் ஆன் வெரி சென்சிட்டிவ் டாபிக்ஸ் லைட்லி பிரஷ் தி டாபிக்ஸ் இஸ் நாட் நாட் ஸ்கேரிங் எனிபடி बिकॉज इट्स ஃபெஸ்டிவ் சீசன் அண்ட் ஹவ் டு பிரிங் a lot of joy and i wish you a very very good christmas reshma so very good christmas this was a great year yes. avanga vandu romba romba for both of us for everybody in our everybody. family too and for all our friends avanga veedu vandu It's like a haven of uh, positivity. We have been able to get together in the week. We have been able to get together in the episode. We have been able to get together with friends. We have been able to get together with friends. We have been able to get together with friends. We have been able to get together with friends. So I want to know that I want to know that I want to know that I have to say that Reshma is a very very good friend and always healthy friend to everybody. On that note, let's wish everybody a very happy Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas and Happy New Year. Yeah, yeah. Happy New Year. We love you. We love you.